Hello there, guys. Welcome back to a short online tutorial. Today, we're based in Adobe Illustrator, and it's your good friend Jack from Blue Sky Graphics back again to show you some really cool stuff. What I would like to do today, guys, is show you how to create this overlapping text effect within Adobe Illustrator. A very simple little idea that you can implement across logos, typography, fronts of magazines, a wide range of uh, designs that you can implement this style on. Um, and I'm uh, going to show you the processes and the steps to take to create such an effect. Okay, so with my selection tool, I'm just going to select everything here and press backspace to remove. And let's use our type tool to create our word. So I'm just going to click on the artboard there and write the word dots. Just going to use my shortcut option on a Mac or Alt on Windows to resize from the center point and shift as well at the same time to keep it nice and proportionate. Now with that selected, I'm going to go to Object, Expand, and let's press OK. And what I need to do is now right click and ungroup this text here. So now if I move this D probably around that amount there, and let's move the T to a point about there, let's say. Okay. So what I need to do first of all is select um, the middle letter, which is the O. And now what I'm going to do is come to Object, Path, Offset Path. Okay. So let's say we increase that to two millimeters here. And let's press OK. Now, if I was to select just the D and the O there, you can see that we have this little space here that I would like to remove. So I'm going to use my Shape Builder tool and the option, uh, so the shortcut you need to press uh, to remove whilst using the Shape Builder tool is Option on Mac or Alt on Windows. And as you can see, if I hover over it, make sure I press that shortcut and remove that section there. And then I just need to re remove this excess bit around here. So same shortcut again and in that middle section there also as well, just to remove that section there. And then just by default, what I'm gonna do is build that element into that element there, to build one whole shape. Okay, perfect. So now what we're gonna do is do the same thing to the T. So select the T, we're gonna to go to object, path, offset path. Let's stick to the two, the same measurement of two millimeters and press okay. Now I'm gonna set the T and the O at the same time. Let's use our Shape Builder tool and same again, option or on the Mac uh, to remove or Alt on Windows to remove. Let's do the same there with that section there. Let's say these little section in there also, let's build that into a shape there. And we need to get rid of that little section underneath there and there also as well. And there you have it guys. That's how you create that overlapping text effect within Adobe Illustrator. If you're interested in finding out more about the school, the courses that we offer, please take a look at our website at bluechgraphics.co.uk. Thank you very much, guys. Take care, and I'll see you next time.